her name is Fausto Rafael Teixeira. But most people call me Tex. I hunt vampires. Now the reason how come I got such a fancy name is on account of my dad being from Portugal. And my mom, well, she didn't give me any names or anything else for that matter. Careful now. Do not shoot, senor. I'm a simple man of the cloth. Have a seat by the fire, Padre. Want some chili? It's only a week old. You are very kind, senor. Coffee? Um, gracias. Where are you headed? I'm not heading to. I'm going away. The town of Dolores is filled with evil. That's where I'm going. I got some business there. Oh yes, you must be Tex, the great vampire hunter. I ain't so great. You are doing the Lord's work. May I bless your revolver? Yeah, and do the bullets too. Make them fly straighter. Elisabetta was my special lady. I didn't even care that she bathed in the blood of virgins to retain her youth. Because I loved her. Betty, I'm so darn happy. Quiet. Let's just be happy. No need to talk about it. I can't help it, darling. I'll follow you and turn heaven into hell. <laughs> and I'll die by your hand, which I love so well. I'm 600 years old. I've heard all the pretty things men have to say. Sorry I've been gone so long. What have you been up to while I was away? Just working. Working? What do you mean working? I thought I was going to quit this god-awful job. Betty, promise me. Do not call me Betty. My name is Elisabetta. She was a lady of the night. In more than one sense of the term. You should be ashamed of yourself, Padre. Okay. Obviously, crosses won't work on you. The most any religious singer would do. A Jewish magician showed me this trick. You make a change in a higher plane, the Sephirah of Yezai. It produces effects in the physical world. <sighs> A holy man, consorting with the painted ladies, and they beat you. Shameful. Oh, brave new world that has such people in it.
but out. Howdy, Tex. Been a while. Hey there, Dixie. Can I get you a drink? Not tonight. Yeah. Betty figured it'd be like that the next time you came around. You're gonna let me through, Dixie? <laughs> you know I can't. I knew you'd come back to me. Then you know what's gonna happen next, Betty. Come on, Tex. Once more for the old time's sake. I wouldn't pay a wooden nickel for your old carcass. When you came here, I thought it was because you have finally discerned the truth. But you are just a stupid cowboy! <sighs> I should have done this a long time ago. I loved you. And this is what it felt like.
see you in hell, Betty. Oh, mistress mine, where are you, Roman? Oh, stay in here, your true love's coming. That can sing both high and low. Trip no further, pretty sweetie. Journey's end in lover's meeting. Every mother's son doth know. Yes, sir.